Good evening, everyone. We had a delightful day today and conditions outside. Well, hey, we're just flipping all over the place right here. All right, let me try this again. <laughs> See if we can reset everything. Well, it is quite nice outside. And here's a look at the temperature right now. We're looking at 45 degrees in the city of Providence. And uh, the dew point is very dry down into the 20s. The wind is out of the southwest at 8 miles an hour. So that's going to help keep our temperatures up a little bit or keep them from uh, really free falling let's put it that way as we do uh, see while we have clear skies right now there will be some high clouds coming in later on tonight and temperatures around the region are still holding in the mid and upper 40s but there are a couple of cool spots as you get up into northeast connecticut 37 degrees there so that's one of the cooler areas that we'll be seeing through the course of the overnight tonight. But even so, even those locations, uh, it'll tend to settle out, uh, maybe uh, getting down to around freezing towards daybreak. The rest of us, though, are going to be in the upper 30s to near 40. But you can see the air down to the south is much milder. And this is going to be coming in our direction because there is a storm system down here in Oklahoma right now. And it is going to be moving in our direction, heading towards the northeast. So for now, high pressure is with us. It's keeping us protected giving us a nice clear day that we had today but that's going to give ground for tomorrow and if you happen to be traveling tomorrow well right now the airports all seem to be on time here at the present moment even though there is the storminess going on down through Oklahoma but again we may see some delays starting to show up around Philadelphia and New York as we get into tomorrow evening so we'll see how that plays out when we get there this is what it's going to look like on our maps for the afternoon. Tomorrow, rain will be moving into the region. And you can see through the afternoon, back through southern New York, northern New Jersey, around the Newark area, there's going to be some periods of heavy rain. That's why I think there may be some delays uh, as we get into the late afternoon or evening hours across the northeast. But this is a fast-moving system. It's going to be out of here in about... 10 hours time, 9, 10 hours. And when it goes by, then it starts to turn cooler Monday afternoon. And the winds will slowly diminish. And as we go into Tuesday, it'll be a slightly cooler day. The high pressure area moves again on top of us. But there'll be another storm system waiting in the wings. This, too, looks to bring us rain as we get into Wednesday night and Thursday. But here's a close view. Here's what's going to happen. Overnight tonight, temperatures dropping down into the mid and upper 30s, near 40 degrees. Rain starts coming in right around 2, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And the breeze will start to freshen up again as well. We're having a little trouble with the graphics, it appears. <laughs> so we'll just reset this. I'll just step out of the screen, so I'll just uh, go over this. Uh, we'll be looking at temperatures that are in the low and mid 50s. Again, the wind increasing during the course of the day. And notice we get into the evening hours. Some heavy your downpours are possible around the city and up towards Woonsocket and Cumberland, perhaps. That'll be moving out right around 11 midnight tomorrow night, and then we start drying out as we head on into Monday, and the temperature's falling very slightly. They will only just barely trickle back to the upper 40s to near 50, so fairly mild night to, uh, for Monday. It's mildest all the way till midday, and though those temperatures will be dropping during Monday afternoon back into the 40s. And rain totals right now looking to be on the order of about a half inch across the region. Some spots will be a little bit less, so there's a little more, so a quarter to a half inch. So here's the recap of everything. Again, tomorrow's the wet day, the afternoon, uh, and into the evening hours. We're into the mid-50s. Low 50s, first half of Monday, falling temperatures in the afternoon. It'll be a cooler day on Tuesday with plenty of sunshine. Wednesday itself, also a dry day for the most part. Getting mild again, back to the mid-50s. And then more rain coming in for Wednesday night and Thursday. That'll end early in the morning. And then we cool down to finish out the work week. Notice Friday is going to be a rather chilly day, starting off in the 20s and only making it back to 44. But maybe getting back to near 50 as we enter next weekend. That's your latest forecast. Let's see what's happening in sports. Here's Ian. Thank you, Bill. We have more on Jeremy Pena's homecoming.